Okay, so I got this new gel blaster in today and uh, it's a HK MP7 red color um, that might not be some people's cup of tea but I think it looks pretty damn sexy um, I've added a little laser sight here just to, uh, just because it looks cool um, straight out the box this thing looks and feels really good it it I had to I had to do a double take on it to 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 work out whether this was plastic or metal I I thought at first that it was metal body um, but I'm pretty sure it's plastic just the the uh, the paint the coating on it makes it appear as if it's uh, metal so comes standard with uh, this retractable stock so you got I think three maybe four no, three three different positions for it and it does come all the way out if you take it all the way out but um the rods I believe the steel rods they feel they feel pretty solid nice little uh, stock there and the large capacity magazine folding forward front grip so you can really get in there when you've got the stock extended and I th think this is pretty cool too so when you've got the stock extended it's got these flip up sights so that um, there they are flipped up flip up flip down so when you've got the stock extended you have the flip up sights so that uh, let me just see if I can get a good angle on this not really there we go so when you've got the stock extended you've got those flip up sights or if you've got the stock retracted so it's like a machine pistol mode even when the sights are flipped down there's still a little functional iron sight so I thought that was pretty cool um, first thing I'll say I'm not particularly fond of um, is the battery location so to get to the battery you have to take this little my little break off then you have to undo these two screws and take that front fascia off to put the battery in the front here um, I've basically worked out that um, if you get a small stick or something and poke it through these holes here if, if you careful get some tweezers or something you can actually poke the um, little battery connector focus you poke it out the side there so you can access it to charge without having to disassemble half the half the uh, blaster and then poke it back in when when your battery's charged but um, other than that little gripe this thing just it just feels awesome it looks awesome I yeah I, I'm yeah super stoked on this one I'm gonna fill the, the mag up for you so it runs on the uh, seven seven mil gel balls and this thing's got like basically full auto or full auto <laughs> it's uh it's got a uh, on and off switch there that's in obviously in the on position and then let her rip oh that's so awesome <laughs> you can go 
Yeah. All right. So that's the whole mag just there. You can go through the whole mag that quickly, but it's so much fun. Um, packs a decent punch and um, it's uh, got quite a, quite a good range on it too. I was um, out in the backyard earlier on and uh, I was easily hitting cans from, from uh, 12 meters. Uh, so yeah, that's uh, it's a great looking blaster. I'm a big fan of this one. So yeah, if you if you're a fan of HK, definitely do yourself a favor and get yourself one of these blasters because they're so much fun. Anyway, once again, thanks for watching. If you like if you like what you're seeing here or if you want me to review something else if you want some more information on any other uh, parts of the blaster hit me up in the comments let me know what you want and I'll be sure to um, look that up for you and let you know all right subscribe to my videos and I'll do some more reviews for you later thanks see you later